why do you love engineering and why how and why and how would you inspire people to go there to go into engineering okay so i guess why do i love engineering you know it's you come in every day and it's different there's there's all sorts of different things to get involved with and you know engineering isn't just one thing it's actually someone described it to me before is it's everything that you you see around you and actually it's true like it is everything you see around me um and it's there's people think that maybe engineering is just one thing and it's not it's it's much much wider than that um and how i would inspire people to come in is actually you know we've got for example all of the the stuff going on with global warming climate change at the end of the day it's engineers who are going to solve that it's it's not you know scientists it's engineering it's it's you know say we have to build a wind farm that's there's engineering say we have to go out and um inspire others in other in other countries to to help fix this climate change like it's it's not going to happen without engineers and i think that's a really strong way of um i don't know how to phrase that but it's it really inspired me when you know when i watched that david attenborough What would be your suggestion to someone who is now on this spot of like, uh, what should I do with my career? Like, uh, you're now an engineer, of course. You're, I mean, I guess you're uh, you're gonna push towards there. But if there was someone in their career and you you were back on uh, when you were deciding on your career, back on uh, your uh, uh, past self, what would you uh, advise this person? Um, work experience. Um... So even in my role now, I'm still not entirely sure what I want to do. Um, but what I'm making sure I do is I, is I try out little things. You know, I'll talk to my manager and I'll be like, oh, can I try doing this for a bit? And I think that, you know, you need to find out whether you enjoy something by by actually doing it. Um, it's like Eliza was saying earlier that she she thought she was going to go into medicine her whole life. And actually then she she tried it a bit and she realized she she wasn't interested in it. The advice that I give to, to anyone that's still just trying to figure out what they want to do is is even if you take a week unpaid as like shadowing someone or like any sort of any form of work experience to find out whether you like something or not any internship any any work experience I think is really really valuable I was very lucky in that I went and did my work experience in engineering and I was like yeah this is it you know <laughs> um, but I know a lot of people that have gone and do work experience in engineering and they think actually I, this isn't for me but I think that that's just as valuable as finding out that that it is for you I think finding out what you don't want to do and what you do want to do just by trying trying everything and yeah putting your finger in all the pies and making sure that you've tried whatever